Hi YouTubers, welcome to one of my videos. I thought I'd cover off a few bits and pieces of kit I have. Some relating to bushcraft, others to do with prepping. An SOS emergency kit that you can buy, which is in a tin, not much more than bigger than a cigarette box. This shows you the size of it and um, it's got some tape to keep it sealed and see if I can get the tape off to start with that's a challenge in its own right I think now oh, here we go God, right. Right, get this tape off right, I can't even remember what's in it right, so I'll get the tape off it's stuck to my fingers Right, let's open it up. So what have we got in here? Hmm. Right, let's have a quick look. What's this? Oh yes. A resealable bag for some reason. What's this? I think that's writing paper. That's nothing to do with it. Oh yeah, I know what we've got in this little bag. We have, I just don't know. This is, pull it out, put the bag sack away. What we've got here, this is a wire saw we can cut things with. I don't know what material it's made out of. It's like a, a saw. What's this? Oh, a compass. Oh, look. This is uh, for lighting fires. Like a fire steel. I'll try that a bit later to go with that. Ah, I know what that is. That's an everlasting match for lighting fires. Let's try it. Sometimes these work first time, don't they? Did you, oh, try, that, try that again. Okay, so that works. So that and that is for fire lighting. Some cable ties. this thing oh a torch a pencil that'd be for the writing paper oh look a multi-tool and that's got a torch so that's a pair of pliers knife screwdriver and pliers that's in one tool that's that uh what else have we got water purifying tablets and each one of these does one liter of water I think this is a whistle. Yeah, that's a whistle. Not a very good one. I don't know what's in here. Let's have a look in here. 
Oh, that's also fire lighting material inside the t in the whistle. Let's see if it works. Yeah, that works. Uh, some rubbish bag cable ties. This is like um, I'm not sure what all these are. It's like a oh, that's a bottle opener there, and that is a tin opener, very sharp. That's a little saw. God, that is sharp. Stainless steel. What's in here? Oh gosh. A ten pound note. And this explains what they are. Right, what have we got? Can opener, knife edge, screwdriver, ruler, can cap opener, four position wrench, butterfly wrench, saw blade, direction auxiliary indication, two position wrench, lanyard keyhole, yeah the lanyard's been removed. Gosh, ten pound note, blimey. So that's it really, I don't think there's room to put anything else much in here but it's good to find ten pound note. The only thing I don't didn't like is this and um, because the lanyard on it, or the piece of string, is too short for, to effectively use the fire steel. So what I'll do, I'll try that fire steel on the work surface. See if I can get a proper spark from it, let's have a go. No, this thing's not very good. Let's try let's try this sharp edge on here. Yeah, let's try that. Hmm. Oh, strange. Not particularly brilliant. No, I'll have another go. Well, I think it wanted just a bit of cleaning up. Let's give it a go. There we go. Yeah, it does work. It's just, it's tarnished. It's not a very good one. But, uh, yeah, so it's usable. So that's really what lets it down. So, would I change anything different? I don't know really this tool it's actually very sharp that is Let's put that back in there keep the instructions go in there see if I can and there's some money which can go in there as well it goes back in that was at the very bottom of the tin I believe Right, the whistle, whistle works fine, I can go back in, right, the torch and this pliers, not a bad little torch, hold that in, can't remember it 
all went back together as it goes like that. I think it does. This little far lighting thing is okay. I don't know how much liquid's in it. I, think I might top that up with some fluid. I think it's lighter fluid. Okay, so I've topped this little lighter thing up with this um, Swan lighter fluid. So that can go back in. That can go back in. And the fire steel, it's going back in. It's not that brilliant, but it can go back in. I'll just hope I'll get everything back in the case. This is an interesting little torch. Not quite seen one of those before. This is the cutting piece. Got that is sharp. Put that back in. Okay, I'll just measure the unit. It's about uh, 65 millimeters by 95 by 30. Weight of the unit. Switch it on. Eight point one ounces or two hundred and thirty grams. Now, in terms of use, I don't know how useful it will be, but there is one of these wire saws, as a knife, screwdrivers, pliers, two different sorts of torches, don't know how good they'd be, um, what else is there, two ways of lighting a fire, some cotton wool material to make a fire with, um, bottle opener, tin opener, uh, something to write with, a bag you could put water in, sterilising tablets, how practical that would be I don't know, um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like and I'll cover off some more of this type of equipment in the next video.